Well, good afternoon. Today is Tuesday. Snow is just about gone here. You can see the grass. You can see the porch. It was up to, what was the temperature, Joe? 50. It was up to 50. So uh, we'll get rid of the snow before we get new snow. So today I'm going to make a breakfast pizza. Um, never made this. I made it yesterday and it was quite good. So I'm starting with one package of crescent rolls and I'm going to unroll it and I have a, a small sheet uh, I think this one is uh, 10 by 15 um, if you want this a thicker use a smaller one uh, they suggest a 9 by 13 so we're going to unroll this and we're going to put it in my sheet and then we're going to pinch these seams together. I uh, sprayed the, sh the cookie sheet here and so we're going to put these together spread them out so it fills quite a bit of this uh, cookie sheet. Just keep pressing them together. Here's the other half of it. These are always the hardest to, to unroll, is this. Okay, another. Let's see another one here. Then I sort of pieced it a little bit um, to get them in. So let's see this one this way. And this one this way throw this in here and just keep uh, pressing it to uh, to make it go uh, fill as much as this as, as you want um, if you don't want to fill the whole thing and of course it'll be a little thicker uh, the crust will be so better up here Make sure your seams, when you uh, separate this, you bring them back together, so. All right. I think I'll let it go this much, because then it'll be a little thicker than I had yesterday. All right. Okay, so there we go. I know it's not totally perfect, but uh, it will do its purpose. Okay, now that I have that, I took um, some breakfast sausage and I browned it yesterday. So I'm just going to put the breakfast sausage on and spread it around. This Take it down to smaller pieces here. I've I've had this, but I've never tried it, and it is really really a simple recipe. So, okay, so I've got the um, the sausage on there, and then I say after the sausage, my glasses are falling. Um, let's see. They're all the meat. I've gotten um, hash browns, so it calls for one cup of hash brown, but you can put more if you'd like. But just cover the the meat with the hash browns. This like sort of spread it out a little bit over top of the meat. So there we go there. All right. So when we get done with that, we're going to put um, a cheese on it. So I'm using, uh, they say you can use any kind of cheese. I'm using regular uh, sharp cheddar. We've got two bags here. It costs for uh, how much cheese? It costs for a cup. 
I'm going to use up some of this cheese up here. So just spread it all along the top. going to be enough. Just spread it toward the toward the edges. So there you go there. Then it calls for five eggs. So I'm going to put five eggs in here and we're going to beat it. So the five, after the five eggs, a dash of salt, a dash of pepper, calls for one quarter cup of milk. There we go. And it also calls for two uh, tablespoons of Parmesan cheese. So I'm just going to eye it here for two, okay, and then we're just going to mix this all up. There we go. And then it wants you to take it and pour it over all, everything that's on your tray, your potatoes, your crust, your cheese, your meat, and just pour it over the top of it. Try to get it all over it. There we go. And just sort of uh, moved around a little bit so all of it's got some of the egg mixture over the top of it. And there you go. Now you could put onions in there if you'd like. Um, it's just like making an omelet. You want to stick some onions in there, go to head. You want to put some tomatoes, throw it on the top of it. So I'm going to put it in my oven at 375. Um, and it's going to go in there for 25 to 30 minutes. I'm going to show you this is what I had left from yesterday's crust on the bottom and so there's your breakfast your breakfast pizza that's one of many I've had other ones that you make a regular pizza crust but this is really a simple one it's quite easy um, doesn't take too long to make the whole thing probably by the time you get done making it you've got 30-35 minutes into it so I'm going to tell you what, what we needed. We needed one package of the crescent rolls. Take them out about 10 minutes before you're going to use them. Um, eight ounces of breakfast sausage. It can be the hot breakfast sausage, spicy, whatever you would like. One cup of shredded uh, hash browns. And it costs from thawed. I threw it on without being thawed and it worked out very good. Um, one cup of uh, shredded cheese. Cost any kind of cheese you would like. Um, get that on your crust and then take five eggs, a quarter cup of milk, half a teaspoon of salt, half a teaspoon of pepper, and two tablespoons of Parmesan cheese. Mix it all together and just lay it on the top of your pizza crust or your crescent crust. And they, uh, they'll turn out like this. Okay, bake it for 25 to 30 minutes. Um, you can eat, eat it, they called to eat it hot. I ate it cold this morning to try it. It was still just as good. So thank you for watching. I hope you all have a um, nice week. I guess we're supposed to get some more snow. I guess we'll wait and see. 
it's not too bad when it snows and snows and snows and the next three days is up from the 40 to get rid of all that that snow. I know our creek behind our house is just roaring. Thank God it's a 55 foot drop off so we're not getting anything flooded around here. So again, thank you very much for watching. I hope you all have a nice day. Take care. Bye-bye.